Now I think it's safe to say that Bluey is not a cartoon just for kids. There are a lot of moments in this show that are gonna leave your jaws dropped. There's so many adult jokes in the cartoon that you gotta see. I'm your host, Kalobi, and let's get into today's video. Unicorns, what's your favorite food? Children. Oh. Can we just give an Oscar award to whoever let this slip in? Seriously, these adult jokes are what make this show. Apparently, Unicorse doesn't like eating food. He likes eating children. If you're unfamiliar with the cartoon, the person behind the puppet is actually Bluey's dad. Her father is really laid back and likes to mess around a lot on the cartoon. He actually loves his children and wants to play a role in their lives. But Bandit, aka the dad, was definitely interrupting Mum here. And why did my accent change? I don't know. Mom was reading a story, but guess who interrupts it? Unicorns! Mom gets so mad that she grabs that thing and throws it on the couch. You gotta really appreciate this cartoon, because it's not just a bunch of stupid jokes. These are real jokes that make adults and kids laugh. And compared to other shows that deal with animals as well, and their humor is subpar. Take a look at Johnny Test. They're right. We do love fart stuff. <laughs> I'm sorry, but if you think that adding a million fart jokes in a cartoon is gonna make adults laugh, I got some news for you. That joke gets pretty stale after a while. I love Johnny Tess, but this new reboot has some really cringy moments in it. It's not as cool as Bluey. Don't get angry at me, I'm sorry, but I have to be honest. Bluey is actually very well written, and later in this video, you're gonna see how they implement tough subjects. Anyways, let's go on to one of the most controversial moments in the show. One day, the kids were putting on a show for their parents, but something catastrophic happens. <laughs> okay, let's keep this moving. So then they... Bingo loses her baby. This is an extremely touchy subject and done the wrong way could cause serious backlash, but the way that Bluey handled it was beautiful. The kids were experimenting with balloons, pretending that they were pregnant, normal stuff that kids do. However, balloons are filled with air and they can pop at any given time. So as the balloon pops, it's implied that something very bad happened. Now adults are the only ones who are going to understand what's going on here. Children are not going to understand the seriousness of this situation. But I want us to all focus on something else. You see, when tragedy happens, people like to focus on the negativity, but I want to focus on the aftermath. Although in life there's a lot of things out of our control, we can choose how we respond to the things that happen to us. We have control over that aspect of our lives. Look at the body language of the dad and mom on the show when she loses her child. Bandit puts his hand to surround the mother's hand to comfort her in this tough situation. But I want everyone watching this video right now to know that you are not limited by your circumstances. You are not defined by what happens to you in this world. You are more than that and you can bounce back with love. The cartoon Bluey says that we are loved. When you watch the cartoon, it teaches us about family values. Anyways, later in the episode, we see something that is really peculiar. Take a look at the way that Bingo blames herself for the loss of her child. It wasn't your fault. It was. This is sad. I mean, am I watching a kid's show or not? I don't care. This is really entertaining because the way that they deal with these issues is surprisingly not cringy and not unrealistic. Unfortunately, many people in this situation often blame themselves, but I'm here to tell you today, you don't have to blame yourself. It is not your fault. But I think this was by far the darkest moment on Bluey. But I still think it's crazy that this somehow is in a cartoon like this. I mean, this is amazing. Some people will say, I don't know if that's necessarily amazing. I love that they touched on this issue, but I don't know if I can call it amazing. Well, I call it amazing. And let me tell you why. When I'm watching a cartoon at my big age in my 20s, I don't want to be watching a boring show of butts and farts and random nonsense and foolishness. I want something that's going to teach me a lesson at the end end of the day. And that's what we see in the cartoon Bluey. When we look at other shows, they're just silly and that's it. Surface level. <laughs> Who wants to sniff my butt? Other cartoons that feature dogs are just forgettable, but Bluey is not forgettable. Now I want you to pay attention to Bluey's words to her sister, to comfort her. No stupid jokes, no butts, no farting, actual love and character development. Take a look at this. We can't do the show without you. Your mom! Offering comfort to her sister, 
the family is brought together. Amazing. There was an episode in Bluey where the dad was pregnant. Now I know that sounds pretty strange, but he wasn't actually pregnant, obviously. It was actually Bingo pretending that he was pregnant. So the dad essentially has to go into labor. Oh, she's got my tummy here. It's not for six, Dad. Wow, there is so much craziness in this cartoon. I'm not gonna lie to you. I don't think we'd see this in any other show. In fact, did you know that there's a lot of things censored in Bluey because people are just babies? I am tired of things just being removed from cartoons like it already exists. Once you put it up on the internet and television, everyone's already seen it, so you might as well just leave it up. Plus, it's not even that bad to be censored. Anyways, the dude gave birth. Hilarious, isn't it? Let's go on to another. You know how I said you're the most special kid in the world? Yes. Well, you're not. <laughs> Oh man, oh man, no, no, no. <laughs> Australia, Australia, I see what you guys are doing, man. This is hilarious, dude, oh my gosh. I mean, you are to me and your mum. We love you more than anything, but you're probably not special to everyone else. <laughs> oh my goodness, I thought he was gonna save it, but he just had to lay it in again, bro. He just had to lay it in rough. <laughs> Isn't it amazing that this quote unquote kids show is able to make us laugh more than adult shows? Like, you know, you're doing something right when a show like this, a cartoon like this is able to make you bust out laughing when you got actual adult jokes that have been running for years like Family Guy, where you can't even crack a grin for the entirety of the 20 minute episode. I mean, that is embarrassing. I'm sorry, Family Guy, but it looks like Bluey actually made me laugh more times. And this is a show about four year olds. Come on, bro. Anyways, we are at the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Alrighty, you guys have a safe rest of your week and weekend, and I will see you guys in the next one. Take it easy and stay awesome. I know there's a lot of parents watching my videos, so I just wanna say, please pledge to my Patreon to help support me make more content like this for you guys. It's only $2.99 a month, that's nothing. Only $5, $2.99, guys, come on, please support me. I wanna make more interesting Bluey videos, so parents, adults, young adults, College students, please pledge your money. In this bundle, you'll get more in-depth reviews and reactions of Bluey from me. Nowhere else are you going to find this content. So watch along and laugh along with me on Patreon. This is hot. So do it now. 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 Right this second.